it is the Saturday wrap, the Saturday wrap for Czechs Notes, Saturday the 29th of June 2024, live, and I keep having to keep my phone alive, live from the John Wallace Linton in Newport, I'm doing it a day ahead, uh, while I got fast internet, um, if you haven't seen this before, thank you for watching, and uh, this is my look back on the week. And a shout out to a gentleman from Berlin, who I will mention later. Anyway, let us start with the word or phrase of the week. Political, with a small p. It really doesn't count in politics unless you've got a gate on the end of it. So we now have pet gate, and we have it from the current two largest parties, and quite a lot of police as well. Everyone's gone betting crazy. Slight exaggeration, but um, Petgate. Yeah, um, 15p each way, something like that. Anyway, moving on, the, the app of the week. It's for iOS and iPadOS and macOS. It's Stop the Madness Pro. Basically, undoing lots of things that people don't want you to do on the internet. Like have native controls and stop things from auto-playing and such like. Uh, this is now the Pro version, which is an update, 8 quid. Unfortunately, support for Windows has now disappeared. And it is somewhat more difficult to get it to work uh, with Edge on the Mac, but it can be done. I like it a lot, and it's a universal payment, so 8 quid did my iPhones, iPads, and my Mac. Uh, your App Store is your friend, and there is an upgrade from the previous version. The thing of the week? Artificial skin on a robot. Um, you need to... you need to go to the BBC uh, Tech website. And it was even on Daily Tech News Show. And it is, it's frightening, it really is frightening. Okay, song of the week. Um, there was a gentleman from Berlin who pointed out that Mystery Train wasn't on the Wild, the Winning, and uh, can't even say, Willing and the Innocent, it was on No Place to Run. However, they're both great albums, really good. The song of the week is Bring Me to Life by Evanescence. That is really wonderful. A mixture of... There's a little bit of rap in there, there's some heavy metal, there's some operatic singing. Ah, it's a classic track. And I miss it. Well, when I say I miss it, I don't play it as often as I should do. So, the week that was. Saturday, Brew Monster in Caffili. I'm still not sure how Dark Element mixes in with them. But it's a great place to go, and the Wi-Fi is good, and the prices are up a little, but they're not too bad. Uh, Sunday, planting out tomatoes and cucumbers. I think I lost one cucumber, cucumber plant, and also I have a feeling another tomato plant is going as well. But I have spares. Always plant and seed more than you need, just in case. And on Sunday... <laughs> completed my postal vote and on Monday posted my postal vote so that's that done um, Monday was uh, emptying the old fridge moving the old fridge the new fridge well it wasn't too heavy it's now in place it's now working I still really haven't leveled it properly but I think it's good I think it's very good to be perfectly honest and uh, 129 quid not bad um, Tuesday went to Ponty was going to the bunch of grapes got there to find that because of kitchen issues it wasn't opening until four o'clock I blame the craft beer because when you have craft beer you have odd opening times even though it is a gastro pub <laughs> um, Wednesday caught the early bus into Newport and went to Costa Coffee by the station it's tiny but there's seats and it's good and I now have at least one extra 
free coffee from them because of the app uh, yesterday planted out um, some more cucumbers planted some guardsmen seeds outside which are spring onions despite the fact no longer spring and um, I had my UFO correction the guy was really nice I like him he's on Mastodon uh, yesterday uh, curry Thursday in the Malcolm Appel Inca Philly and a message from Reddit about a post I made a year ago with a picture of Caffili Castle on it saying would we be able to use it and did you take it and I think the answers were yes and yes and today back in Newport where it is nice and cool because Wednesday was high summer and boiling and everyone was complaining about it it's still a bit dry though and the overnight rain we should have had overnight didn't seem to appear it's been one of those weeks oh yeah been on leave all this week first time I've been on leave for ages where I actually haven't booked to go away it's just been do things as I want to do them and it's been well the weeks just disappeared anyway thank you for watching and discrepancies and inaccuracies don't be afraid to let me know. Bye-bye.